Okay, we're going to uh, videotape the set of pig lungs, which are now completely de-recruited, uh, being ventilated by the percussion air VDR4. So I'm going to hook them up. And that is a pulsatile flow rate of 40 on the proximal airway pressure monitor. And right now we have a uh, I time of 2 seconds, an E time of 2 seconds. As I said, our uh, convective pressure rise is 40 centimeters. Our oscillatory percussive rate is uh, 500 approximately. And we don't have any uh, CPAP, uh, either demand or oscillatory, dialed in. I'm going to put a couple of uh, demand CPAP in to show you what we normally would put on it. You can see that we're still largely de-recruiting on expiration. And now I'm going to put some oscillatory CPAP on to show you the effect of oscillatory CPAP. You can see the lung begin to oscillate not only on inspiration but now on expiration. And we do have a uh, oscillatory IE of 1 to 1 within the oscillatory rate itself. Now I'm going to add in convective pressure rise. And you can see the recruitment of the lung there. Now I'm going to take the convective pressure rise off. And if need be, we can add some more oscillatory CPAP. to help keep the de-recruitment in check on expiration and to facilitate CO2 removal. And again, we can take the oscillatory CPAP completely off and you can see the lung de-recruit down to just our demand CPAP. Take that off. And now we're just ventilating at pulsatile flow rate at approximately 15 minutes. You can see the adelect trauma that could occur with this type of lung model. And the lung is disconnected from the BDR and completely de-recruited.